YouTube channel um, this video is basically about getting to know me so I posted on my Instagram story to ask you guys questions for answer you see in this video so those are what I'm going to answer right now so yeah you guys get to know me inside and out. not really inside and out but yeah so let's get into the video so basically my name is Tishana Collins yeah, Tishana Collins. Um, I'm currently 18 years old. Currently, Jesus guys, I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm nervous, but soon, guys. So yeah, I'm 18 years old. Um, my birthday is March 10, 2003. So your girl is a Pisces. Period. But yeah, I'm a Pisces. Best month. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you. So basically, I have my book right here. So the Christians name. So yeah. Okay, somebody asks, how tall am I? Um, I don't know. Like the last time I got medical, they checked my height and they said I was 5 feet 6. But recently, when I go look for this ID, the lady checked my height and like she said, no man, I want to take up a few inches off of that because I the slippers I'm going to have on. Because so my height was 5 feet 4. So, I guess I'm just going with 5 feet 4. I don't know. What is my favorite food? I do not have a favorite food. I have a favorite food. I wouldn't consider myself having a favorite food because I don't see me eating something every day. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, my favorite food, I would say, is chop suey. Like, if you guys live, I don't know if you said that America too, but yeah. Every Friday, my father buy chop suey for me because, like, I'm on my weight loss journey. And like, I just find chop suey the healthiest option for me because I don't want to fry chicken. I don't want, you know, them could fry fry it. No, it's when they buy fried chicken, come give me, I don't want that. So, yeah, I would say my favorite food is chop suey because when you eat it and just don't get tired of it. What is my biggest fear? Well, I would say my biggest fear is failure. You know, like, me just can't see myself a fail, sit down with broke pocket, not no money for spend, you know? So, I think my biggest fear is failure and losing my loved ones. Like, every, like, sit down and mates and so, like, general stars, everybody where you know, know I got one day dead, and, like, a year alone I got left, and, like, that just scare me, you know? Like, me say, Jano, my mother I got dead one day, my granny I got my say when I think about it is that I just want to ball me thing. But the next <laughs> the next question is what are your hobbies? My hobby is basically singing, like I would just sit down and just start sing. Yeah. I'm like for relax. You know like yeah, you know, I'm like nobody bother me. So I'm like for relax, I look a tired body because me I work out and I need to relax, you see? So yeah. Another question is saying that what career path will you be choosing? Well, me, I'm like a lost horse in this world. Like, I'm just going with the flow at this point because when I was younger, I used to say that I want to be a lawyer. And then after in grade nine, when I have this career day, I went to the career day. And like, the lawyer session was so boring. So I said, no, I can't see myself. I do this for job here. Mm -mm no <laughs> so yeah i changed my mind i changed that from grade nine period and then i went to this vet session and like when my friend said you're gonna need sciences for be a vet i said no this a girl yeah yes science subject me i tell you me i have a i'm saying i say me me hate bio me hate chemistry me hate physics me hate all of them science subject they like mm -mm. Most of my favorite subject is maths because ever since primary school, my grade 6 teacher, she loved maths. And like, she just made me love maths too. You see, so ever since that, I was, I just grown to love maths. Okay? Yeah. So yeah, the next question is, how are you mentally? Mentally. 
Well, the person who asked this, if I did ask me this from months before when I was preparing for Cape, I would say I wasn't at my best mentally nor physically because I was so stressed out. As I said, my biggest fear is failure. So when I was procrastinating with studying, it's like it just started to stress me because I said general studies, but no one feel them exam year. You see, like my no one feel and like I was just starting to stress and I was starting to eat a lot in the late night. I may tell you my gain weight, I'm end up and lose it back. So yeah. But now I would say I'm somewhat good mentally. So yeah. What are my pet peeves? Well I think my pet peeve is bad breath. Yeah. I hate when people come talk to me with them stinking breath like no stay so don't talk to me with their stinking breath so yeah I hate when people smell bad basically bad odor you see so I don't like when people smell bad you see if you have their own means just smell nice you see so yeah I think yeah I think I have more pet peeves but it's just not coming to my brain right now so let's move on how many piercings do I have well, currently I have four piercings. I could have six piercings because I've I pierced up here and my ears, um, on both ears. But I end up and take out the earring because my father has something else. My father is something else. So yeah, I have four piercings right now, currently. Yeah, probably I get more ear piercings when I grow up. Probably I pierced back up here. I don't know. Probably. Um, what was your dream job as a kid? As I said before, I wanted to be a lawyer. Like everybody that tell me to be a lawyer, because I am a person who love for chat. Me say me will chat, me will chat, me will chat, me will chat, me will chat. So till I'm not tired. Like sometimes I talk a lot until my throat starts to get dry. Me I tell you, even right now my throat I get dry. <laughs> Because I can talk a lot. But say sometimes I feel really wonder if people not tired. Like people can't tell me to shut up. Because I'm a chat too much. Like general stars. But yeah. So not a question, but let us hear you sing. Uh, right now, because I talk a lot, my throat is dry. So I don't know what I'm gonna sound. I don't know which song I might sing. Like I don't know a song on top of my brain right now. Probably at the end of the video, if I think of a song, I will sing it. Fave childhood memory. Well, me, I enjoyed primary school the best. I feel like primary school is where I enjoyed most of my life. Primary school, I used to idle. When actually to finish, we go outside, we run up and down, we jump gully, we do this, we do that. So yeah, my first childhood memory is basically when <laughs> when lesson was finished at primary school. And like we are on as I said, we run up and down, we hide, we do this, we jump gully. Hey, so brother, yes, when me see my grade six teacher, like my grade six teacher, yeah, she's the same one, what you do? I say when we see her drive out, no we let a duck, cause we don't want her pursuing. <laughs> We're not want to have to see we, not at all. Another favorite childhood memory is when Fair Day. Fair Day at the best time of my life. Disco room. Mm -hmm. um, the next question is fave Jamaican restaurant. Um, I don't go out. I really do not go out. The few restaurants I've been to was um, Trio restaurant for my 18th birthday. I went to, which other restaurant I'm going? 100, yeah, I went to 100. 100 is kind of nice, but trust me, somebody got 100 for my father's birthday. My, my other things, I let me never know say I so much food I did all the So I see the food, I come up, I say, I so much food I did all the Let me never know. Like, trust me, I know, know it did burn my mother. Like, it did hurt my mother for me and all that so much food. But me, myself, I never know say I so much food I did all the Like, really and truly, never know. So where do I see myself the next five to ten years? Well, the next five to ten years, I will be. Don't look at maths. I will be like 23, 28, them age. Day. Where do I see myself? I will probably still be in school at the age of 23. I don't know. 
but I really want to see myself better in life like I really want to have a house a car yeah I just want to find a dream like a job that pays enough money yeah honestly yeah once me enjoy the job and pay a good amount of salary then me good yeah so yeah i see myself in a house um with my car traveling the world because i've been wanting to travel the world but as i said my life boring <laughs> really boring like me not going away me never like the only place i actually travel go is usa and i one time alone i actually travel like trust me one digger digger time so yeah which country do you wish to travel um, I wanted to go to Paris. Yeah, I want to go to Paris. Um, I want to go to Canada as well. Um, I see this girl on Instagram. She goes somewhere one day for her birthday, and it looked really nice. But I love to go there. So I think of Panama. I think of Panama. She went. I would love to go at Panama, like honestly. But yeah. Um, how do you get along with your family? Like me, me I'm, I'm kind of like a person where I'm mm, gonna say no. I kind of get upset easily. Like I'm not like when people bother me, as I say. When people get on my nerves, I just go in on my feelings. So how how me and my family get along? Mm, like. I don't know. I really don't know. Like we don't have a bad relationship, but it just on and off. If you know, get what me I say. But with my grandmother, um, we have a good relationship. My auntie as well. It's just my mother and my father. But kind of, you know, not living at them all. So sometimes it just get on the nerves. But other from that, my relationship good. Yeah, my relationship good. So the next question is any collab videos yes i plan on doing collabs with other youtubers with friends yeah i plan to do that what motivates me as i said before my biggest fear is failure if me afraid of failure then yeah i'm gonna use that to motivate me because i don't want to fail so all those procrastinating i've been doing with studying that's all the time i procrastinate when it comes on to studying I really think I'm saying, I say, I don't want to feel, so I'm going to study. You know? So, I think that is what motivates me. Just the fear of failing. <laughs> so, yeah. Do you have any siblings? I have one sibling. She's my sister. Yeah, she is three years older than me. Yeah. Yeah. So, next question is, what's your favorite subject in school? As I said before, my favorite subject is maths. I love maths. Right now, I'm doing pure maths. Some people say my mad fear the pure math, but trust me, pure math is a lot of work. Pure math took up all of my time. Yeah, tell you no. You see, if you want to do pure math, just make sure so you don't have enough time for pure math. You see that teacher there? That teacher did a mad me. I said, did a mad me right through. Right, right through. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you're in my class, you don't let no say. Yeah, me and him ever do back and forth. Like, him cost me, me cost him, we cost each other. Yeah, that is just us our relationship yeah <laughs> you mad me like, honestly i'm not like, i'm tired of telling sister i'm tired and yeah my mother but i need to get some multivitamins the one them for the old people you know excuse excuse yourself <laughs> but um yeah the next question is what will your channel be about basically lifestyle um, I can't do makeup, so I wouldn't say makeup. Um, if I buy clothes, cause right now I need a new wardrobe, my tailor look old pop down clothes I'm have now. So when I get a chance to buy a bag of clothes, then I will do try and all. So I can do vlogs, all those good things. You know, advice, story time, story time, yes, story time. Here, yeah, I'm not gonna say. I have no story time to tell you about. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just leave that for the next video. Yeah. So the next question is, are you an introvert or extrovert? I would say I'm an omnivert. I'm sometimes outspoken and I'm sometimes love my own company. Next question. On a scale of 1 to 10, 
great your childhood experience i'm a person that don't have the princess lavish childhood you see my childhood experience my father own a wholesale no found in all this but yeah him own a wholesale i've been in this house from i was little and i was helping in the wholesale the shop i've been lifting weights I've been doing this, I've been doing that, and I guess that is what caused my back pain you now because sometimes when I walk, if my walk too long, my back hurt me, like my lower back. If I stand up too long, my lower back hurt me. Like, yeah, my back will kill me. So, yeah, on a scale of 1 to 10, my childhood experience, um, I would say like a 7 because it isn't the best and it isn't the worst because I know some people have worse than that. So, I'm grateful for what I have, yeah. So I was say like a seven to eight, yeah, or six, seven. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's the end of the questions. I'm thinking of a song to sing right now. I just want a song now come to me. But when I hear this, I'm just put on the spot. I like no song now come to my brain. Right, not even one song. I'm thinking of one song. <clears throat> think of no song right now sorry to disappoint you guys <clears throat> i didn't sound my best i really did not because as i said i talk a lot when i talk a lot my throat get dry and it just cause cracking and all those things so yeah that is the end of the video i hope you guys enjoy it and i hope you guys like this video and subscribe Hit the post notification bell and share this video and tell your friends, family, everybody to come over here and subscribe to my beautiful channel. Yeah. And I just hope you guys want to see more of me and I hope you guys will support me on this journey. Yeah. Right now, like, my goal is 500 subscribers. I'm currently at 340 subscribers, I think. So I hope with you guys help you guys would help me to grow and thing and thing so thank you guys for watching and i hope you guys know me as much as i know myself and along this journey you guys will get to know me more as well so just stick with me and subscribe hit the post notification bell so you can be alerted when i post so yeah bye